Hi, I'm QDC. What we're about to build today is Tamiya's um, M4A3 EH Sherman Easy 8 Korean War. And this is a special kit. Um, actually, there's two kits in one. Not only that this kit has the, the Sherman tank, it also includes another Tamiya kit called uh, the Gaz 67B Scout Car from, from the Soviet Union. So when I got this particular kit, I didn't know that this kit included the scout car. And so my imagination was going wild. And so I decided to make a diorama out of this uh, Korean War Sherman tank. And I'm going to call it the Forgotten War. So what I'm going to build first in probably a three part series is first I'm going to build the Gaz 67B from this model kit. And then second, I'm going to build the figures um, from another kit. I'll talk to you more about that later. And then finally, I'm going to build the Sherman tank and make it into a diorama. So this is going to be a, I would think this is a good, a good video, um, but really I'm just doing it just to inspire you to build your own model kits. So let's go ahead and start building the Gaz 67B model kit right now from this particular kit. So we built the model kit and now it's time for me to show you what I think about this kit so far. Take a look. This is a computer model kit before painting and I did find this kit a little difficult to build. It was because of the instructions but since this kit came with the Sherman tank I'm not complaining about that. So if you're finding this kit by itself I think this is a worthwhile kit to build, especially if you like Russian cars. It's time for me to paint the model.
Okay, so we built the model kit, we painted it, we weathered it, and we even made a small diorama out of it. So it's time for me to show you the entire model kit from the beginning to the end. Take a look. This is the completed model kit after painting and weathering, and I did a good job. Um, what I like about this model kit is really the paint job that I've done for the the rust here on the hood. It does look like this scout car got caught on fire uh, with an engine fire, and it just caught on fire. And now you just see the aftermath of it. It looks that good to me, at least. And the rest of the weathering I've done looks pretty good and the diorama base where the car crashed into the bomb crater looks pretty good as well so that completes this model project what you're about to see is a video slideshow of the entire model kit but before I go as always just because I put this mo uh, this video here on YouTube it doesn't make me a model kit expert I am NOT an expert I'm just a regular guy just like you so please, build a model kit of your own. I'm QDC, and thanks for watching. Bye-bye.